Hey guys, it's me, Drew, and welcome back to my channel. I believe this is the first time I've ever shared a scent and warmer of the month kit video with you guys. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure. And what a better month to celebrate it than March. March is my birthday month, and the second I saw this warmer and the scent, I knew I had to get it. Now, if you're wondering, but Drew, you're talking about March's scent and warmer of the month and it's February. Well, that is a consultant perk. So as a consultant, I am able to order the scent and warmer of the month kit a little early. So I have a chance to experience it myself, share it with you guys. If you're interested in purchasing it, I'll leave my link down below. But I think Easter is such a fun holiday. I love the Easter bunnies. I love the little eggs. I just think it's all so cute. And when I saw this warmer, and I'll be honest, I'm not a huge fan of gnomes. And last year's Easter warmer was a gnome and I opted straight out of that. But this year, it is an Easter bunny. Now it is a picture here, but pictures only tell a little bit of the story. Let's talk about the warmer, you guys. Look at this warmer. This warmer is called Hoppy Easter and will be available for $54 on the first of the month. So as you see, we have a little bunny, his pink ears, his purple bow with the gold polka dots, all of that, the little Scentsy logo back here, as well as the indicator light on his bum and a little tail. Now this is an element warmer, so there is no light bulb. It's just going to be a dish where you can insert your wax in here. And on the bottom here, this is an eight, no, nope, hold on. Yep, an eight watt element warmer. So this is gonna get eight watts hot. So pretty good for an element warmer. It has a nice big dish. So you're able to put your wax in here and make your home smell delicious. Now for the month of March, this is available for 10% off. So it is $54. The full price is 60. So if there are any left on April 1st, which I can't imagine because this bunny is just too adorable. It will go back to that $60 price, but I love that it looks like carved wood. It's so cute, so petite. And like for me, I leave my element warmers on 24 seven. So in my entryway, I'm gonna have him here with an Easter wreath, a little Easter egg set up. I'll actually take a picture whenever I have it all set up, but I'm obsessed with him. I think it's so cute. And what better scent to put in an Easter bunny than strawberry lemon cake. Bakery lovers, unite. I feel like Scentsy really does not like us bakery lovers in the fall and winter, and or in the spring and summer, but this strawberry lemon cake, delicious, right? So the notes on strawberry lemon cake are, fresh strawberries add a sweet surprise to lemon zest and vanilla buttercream, creating a perfectly delicious confection. So we have strawberry lemon cake here. It's such a bright, fun pink wax. And let's give it a sniff. This is so good, you guys. It is bakery. It is sweet. It's lemon and strawberry. I've seen a lot of people say that it reminds them of strawberry pound cake from Bath and Body Works. I can see how you can see that it's a little bit similar, but I definitely get the lemon zest in here. And not that I'm a baker by any means, but I have heard that when you add like lemon zest or orange zest to like a cake, it just accentuates the flavor of the others in there. So the strawberry, the lemon enhances that strawberry, which is why it smells so strongly of strawberry. This is delicious. I am so excited to get to melting this one. And in the kit, I actually get eight bars. So I am able to melt this throughout my apartment and really get a good feel for it. But not only is that launching in March, but I also figured what better video to put it in than the Easter collection. So we are getting a mini Easter collection. That gnome is coming back as well as a Scentsy Buddy and these three bars. Now these three bars you can only buy in a trio for $17 launching on March 6th, Monday, March 6th, I believe is the day. And 
But if you don't want all three of these bars, if these guys all don't sound up your alley, you are able to add just one to your Sensi Club. That way you can try it out, see what you think, if you wanna keep it, if you wanna leave it. But I did get the trio early, so that way I could talk about it with you guys. There are three bars. We will start, I'm looking at my laptop with the notes, with Mandarin Zest right here. It is like a very pale, almost like a daisy yellow color. And the notes on Mandarin Zest read, sweet mandarin and watery pear bring out sunshine and blue skies with a hint of vanilla. This is a very citrus body care. Yes, it's definitely mandarin, like a very sweet, juicy orange scent. Pear, sunshine, blue skies, and vanilla. Mm, I'm just really getting a very light citrus. Nothing super strong, just like a very light, bright citrus. I like it, but I hope it's really strong. It's not smelling super strong on cold, so we will see, but that is Mandarin Zest right there. Next, we have, what a fun name, Pink Berry Fluff, and it is pink as well. And this says, Pink Berry, Marshmallow and vanilla bean swirl in an airy, irresistible combination. And yes, pink berries are a thing. This smells very sweet. Sweet berries. Yeah, marshmallow also smells pretty light. Yeah, like a sweet marshmallowy pink berry scent. Nothing too crazy. Definitely light. Pink, girly, candy berries. It's nice. Nothing to write home about, but it's nice. So we have pink berry, right? Pink berry fluff right there. Fluff with the marshmallow. And then last but not least, we have violet spun sugar right here. And this is tart cloudberries meet violet water and spun sugar for a celebration of whimsy. Now we did have a scent, cloudberry dreams, which I was not a fan of. This is, not, it's definitely tart. You can definitely tell that that cloudberry is a tart berry because it's very sour, but not like sour candy. Definitely like a sour berry fruit. The violet just adds a hint of floral and I'm personally someone who loves a fruity floral because florals on their own are beautiful. I do love a floral in the spring, but when you add a fruit to it, it just adds an extra layer of beautifulness if that's a word, beautifulness, to the fragrance. Yeah, this is so pretty. Ooh, I like that, it's really strong. This is definitely my favorite, which is a shock. I didn't think it would be, I thought the Mandarin would. But yeah, this is nice. This is really pretty, and I love the violet color. So there you have it. Those will be available on March 6th. Let me know down below if you plan on picking this collection up or that adorable bunny. Are you decorated for Easter yet? When do you typically decorate for Easter? Let me know down below. As always, make sure you hit that subscribe button and that notification bell. That way you're alerted every time I upload a video here on YouTube. Make it a better world. I love you all so much and be kind. Bye guys.